In this video, I'm going to introduce you to Simulink Coder's key capabilities. I'll start with a familiar simple second order system in continuous time domain with a fixed step solver. Before generating code, we'll first simulate the model as shown here. Using the default coder settings, I'll generate code now by clicking the build button. I choose to generate a report along with the code. As you can see, the code generation report pops up at the end of the build process and shows the generated code and other information. Now if we go back to MATLAB, you can see that an executable was created in the current working directory to conclude the build process. I can run this executable within MATLAB using the exclamation operator, but this model is not set up to be interactive and will simply run forever. Let's enable interactive parameter tuning using external mode. We can also log data as shown here. These options are quite helpful when using Simulink Coder for its main purpose of rapid prototyping or hardware in the loop testing. Let's now go ahead and build the executable. For parameter tuning, I'll run the executable from operating system command window and connect it with Simulink model as an external mode control panel. With a successful connection, I can go ahead and change the tunable parameters. Notice that I changed the damping coefficient and the response changed in the scope. The mat file shown here contains logged input and output signals that I can plot in MATLAB. For more details and to get started, refer to the documentation tutorials here. As mentioned before, this example model uses a fixed step solver. However, if you would like to use a variable step solver, you can take advantage of our SIM system target file provided with Simulink Coder. Our SIM is helpful for Monte Carlo and parameter sweep studies involving plant models. Simulink Coder is the base product that lets you generate code from a Simulink and state flow model. It allows you to perform the basic real-time capabilities that I showed you in this video. However, if you would like to generate code for automated real-time test systems, look at the videos for Simulink real-time product. And to generate highly optimized and customized code for production embedded systems, please examine the videos for embedded coder. For more information about Simulink Coder and related products, please click on the links below.